I just have to load a bunch of stuff in, obviously. Sweet. I'll just keep chugging away on that, and then once Gary's set up, we'll get him going. So we are here today having our drum recording session with Gary Craig, an amazing drummer who just won a Maple Blues Award. And um, Amanda and I met Gary back in 2007 when we went on a tour with Tom Cochran, our very first Cross Canada tour. And Gary was and still is the most gentlemanly, lovely guy ever and a phenomenal drummer. And I'm just honored that he's going to play on my album. So uh, we're going to go Me through. Me too. Are you? <laughs> <laughs> Yay. So uh, yeah, so I think we're doing about seven songs today from the upcoming solo album. And uh, we're going to start with Fishing Boats. So, yeah. So I've got a multitude of, well not that many things, but I've got a lot of different snare sounds. Ooh. From super quiet to big and loud and deep. And so we can go all kinds of places. And big cymbals that sound like ocean waves and things like that. Oh, so you just said the magic word. <laughs> whenever you have an idea, mm -hmm. uh, just like be the producer big time and oh, go yeah. for it. And, and I, I have ideas, but uh, yeah, it's just like, and even if you use funny references like colors or anything. Oh, I'll use a bit, lot of visual because I wouldn't it. know the technical term. Totally. That's so great. Basically, like for fishing boats, for example, I want it to be like, I don't know, when you think of kind of ancient Lord of the Rings, haunted countryside, right. windswept, treeless. Right. So that's, that's my drum instruction. <laughs> Can you just make that happen visually? Yes, God, I want your drums to sound like downstairs at Downton Abbey. <laughs> oh, yeah! <laughs> We're done! Yeah, let's get something, like, play something firm and solid that we can That's good. make sure everything's working. I kind of tuned the toms a little bit for this track, but okay. I'll still do a, a standard drum check. But sure. the toms are kind of already there for this, okay. this track. Yeah, that, that's great. Yeah. Just... <laughs> <laughs> Never less funny. <laughs> I can hear the night wind in the fishing boat. Yeah, it's like the wind, wind blowing there at the end. Okay. But no wind chimes. <laughs> it's beautiful. Yeah, everything you like curated the song. It's amazing, Gary. <laughs> There's two things you gotta know about the studio. We've got Confidence antlers, that's what they're they're called. And more importantly, Bluntstone Shrine. <laughs> Which no studio is complete without. So just you come to Union Sound Company, you lay your, your quarter by the Bluntstones and all will be well. It's a perfect sounding snare. <laughs> what about the vocals, Jerry? <laughs> Snare. Okay, okay, but it's a snare. Without the snare, this record is doomed. <laughs> it's a dude. Let's talk about the snare. I really like the patch chord. Yeah, yeah. 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 So far, it's going pretty great. We did two songs already in like an hour, so, wow, he's a pro. <laughs> what kind of direction did you give him today? I mean, I, obviously it was just like Phil Collins fills all day, <laughs> every day. <laughs> it's gonna be the best album ever. I mean, I'm gonna enjoy it, just for the comedic value. 